Hello, this is Carillion, and welcome to episode 13 of my Let's Play Mass Effect 3 as Carillion Shepard, a vanguard on insanity difficulty, acting as a paragon, with the occasional renegade welcome, thrown in Commander when it's Shepard. necessary. Please select One moment, we actually please. have to come to this docking area to do several of the ARIA missions that we have, and then we will continue from there. I don't think I have to go talk to ARIA yet. Now but arriving we'll at Docking out. Bay E24, Force emergency civilian housing. Nothing going on here. Leon is on Earth, it's a beautiful city. You should visit. Okay. Nothing here. She is not back. Oh, holy Kelly is going to be okay. He is a darner boss. Wow. Arya wasn't kidding. The great commander Shepard on a leash. I'm here for my own reasons, Vosk. Oh, sure you are. Anyway, tell her I'm impressed, but to do business, I still need my little problem taken care of. Which is? A Torian general named Oraka has it out for the Blue Suns. He's raising a stink over our activity in this sector. I'll commit my gang to Arya as soon as Oraka's dead. What are you not telling me? There must be more to Oraka's complaint. We're just making little raids along trading routes. With Arya's blessing, I might add. Oraka's just some military fossil who came out of retirement to relive the glory days and justify his existence. Losing him won't affect your war in the least, but gaining the Blue Suns, well, you know our work. I'm not gonna kill him. You seriously think I'll assassinate a Turian general? Arya seems to think so. Or else, why would she send you? She knew the price. The two of you work it out. Oh, and, uh, <laughs> tell Arya I still expect her blue ass in bed with me. Yeah, good luck with that one. What is it, Shepard? You knew about this? Can you be more specific? Darner Vosk expects me to kill General Araka. Who cares what Vosk wants? What he needs is for Araka to stop disrupting his operations. I figured you'd talk to Araka, see if you can get him to lay off. And if he won't listen to reason, call me, and I'll take care of it. That would be the same thing if I have you kill him. I don't see the distinction. The distinction is that I'm giving you the chance to save his life. Right. Why didn't you just tell me this yourself? Vosk needed to see you. Needed to realize who he's dealing with. Plus, if I have to suffer that scumbag staring at my tits one more time, I might have to kill him. Yeah. He mentioned... That I'm going to sleep with him? We all have our delusions. Okay. What about the food we were promised? It's been allocated to the Presidium. Then contact Commander Bailey over at CSEC. Tell him Garrus hey Carrion would consider it a personal favor if he could reallocate the shipment so these people don't starve. Men, get ready for trouble. Not here for that, Sane. Just want to talk about Jonas Sedaris's release. Oh. You're the one coordinating that, right? My idea, you know. Arya came to me looking to gain Eclipse support. I'm leveraging it to bust the boss out. Why? You don't need her. Sane, you should run Eclipse. Huh? You can do it. Leave Sedaris locked up and make the deal with Arya yourself. Hmm. Arya would be a step up. And you think she'd let me run things? I don't see why not. Right. Right. Then that's the plan. Keep Sedaris in jail. I'll call Arya right away. Good man. Okay. Now we need to go talk to Araka. See if we can get uh, into a back off. If you do not remember, he was from Mass Effect 1. Uh, he was spreading lies about. Um, Shepard, the council withdrew the, council. the release order for Sedaris. Arya, Talok of all people, got him to do it. Crazy. You can say that. Thanks for your help, Shepard. 
No problem there, Bailey. You and I got each other's back. They mainly you've got mine in the past. Um, Presidium One Commons. Moment, so we have to bounce back and forth all of these places. But you kind of have to go to the Commons to get the stuff to go to one. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. I guess it doesn't matter how I do it. I just need to tell him about us. Us. You and me. He doesn't need to know that. Wouldn't it be better for him to just know that you'd grown apart? I thought I was supposed to be honest with him. You are. But you're just being tactful. Not rubbing it in. And I'd rather he did not come back and shoot me in the head. Just cause, you know, that would be painful. Um, okay, down here. Yeah, General. Commander Shepard. General Araka, I think we met in Korra's den. You were pretty miserable, if I recall. Yes, neck deep in drink just before I retired. I'm clean now, reinstated. I hear you're taking on the Blue Suns. I need to do my part for the Citadel, Commander. The Blue Suns are raiding CSEC weapons shipments. I'm putting a stop to that. Those mercs are seriously jeopardizing the Citadel's ability to defend itself if the war comes here. When the war comes here. There are other ways to secure weapons, General. You don't think I've tried? There's a black market dealer on Citadel right now, but he won't sell his top-line arms. The Reapers are destroying everything in their path, and I can't stop them. But I can stop the Blue Suns. I'll get weapons for you. Let me see what I can do for you. I'd appreciate your help, and I'll have a plan of action ready if things fall through. It'd be really good not to have to kill Araka. Kinda like him. He cleaned up stuff later. Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. It's over here, where I am with the next part. Oh yes, Kennec. So is that the next standover, but this works. Look, Commander, I don't want any trouble. I'm authorized to sell here, and all my arms are legal, see? These are lightweight weapons. Where's your top-end inventory? Shit, you slumming for C-Sec too? I already got harassed by the old Turian with a bad attitude. Yeah, I got much better stuff, but it's off the market. Galaxy's going belly up. Credit won't mean anything once the Reapers rip through. What do you mean? So what exactly are you saying? Whatever happens, I figure there'll be survivors, but it'll be chaos. I'm betting things will run on a barter system. So I'm getting a jump. My best stock only trades for hard goods and artifacts with real value. So what are you looking for? So, what gets me access to your top shelf? Heh, <laughs> Turian just waved credits in my face and then spat on it. Nice to see you have flexibility. If you find any rare pieces when you're out saving the galaxy, bring them back. Then I'm happy to share my top stock with CSEC, no problem. Outside of that, I gotta stick to my guns. Quite literally. Okay. So, the last one will require us to travel the galaxy since we don't want to just kill Araka. <coughs> but that's okay. So it's pretty much time for us to head out anyway. Okay. At this point, I believe we're going to the docking area where we should be able to find Miranda. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please, one moment, please. And then, after that, we'll pick where we want to go. Hmm. Now arriving at docking bay D24. Okay. Anything over here? Sorry, intelligence is reporting sightings of Reaper forces in the Salian. Not really. Now there's Miranda. Shepard, over here. Listen, honey, please. This is how it has to be. Everybody Commander Shepard, it's been far too long. We live in interesting times. A little too interesting. I couldn't get anywhere near you when the Alliance had you locked up. Relieved of duty. It was complicated. I'm sure it was. I'm surprised they didn't court-martial you. 
The Alliance isn't known for its flexibility. Doesn't matter now. Shepard, about Earth. Yeah, it was pretty bad. Countless people lost their lives within minutes. The Reapers are everything we feared. They should have listened to you a long time ago. I'm sorry, Shepard. What about you? What brings you here? I need to talk to a few people. Like you. The Citadel is a good place to meet. For now. What's the Alliance's next move? We have a plan. It's a long shot. <sighs> Not surprising. Shepard? There's... something I wanted to mention. What is it? I haven't heard from my sister, Oriana, for a while. I'm getting worried. Your sister? Yes. I don't want to overreact, but... Well, there's a lot going on. I thought we made sure she was safe. We did. It's probably nothing, but... I just know my father is involved. What happened? I don't know. Everything I had in place to make sure she was safe went dark. Is there anything you can do to help? What do you need from me? I appreciate the offer, Shepard. But you have your hands full. If I need a door or two kicked down, I know just who to call. But for now, I'll be fine. Okay. I understand. I have to figure this out. You could tell me more. You will. Um... Tell me about Cerberus. Have you had any run-ins with the elusive man? Just once. He said it had been a pleasure to work with me. But he needed to contain the situation. Contain the situation? Sounds final. It nearly was. He doesn't take rejection well. No. He doesn't. Um, how's your father doing? Why do you think your father was involved in Oriana's disappearance? Totally wrong. I kept careful tabs on my sister. I always knew where she was. For her to just vanish, it could only be him. After I hid her away, I still knew he'd stop at nothing to find her. She's all he has left. I have a hunch what happened. But I'll fill you in when I'm certain. Okie dokie. And where have you been for the last year or whatever? It's been a long time. What happened to you? I've been in hiding. Being on the run from just about everyone isn't as glamorous as it sounds. I didn't know. It's all right. I knew there would be repercussions to walking away from Cerberus. I imagine. You're a dangerous enemy. I am. Did you find what you're looking for here? If you're looking for a lead here, anyone associated with Cerberus will be hard to find. No question. But I'm owed a few favors. Someone here will give me a tip on Ariana. I need to go. I've got to get back to it. And I should get out of sight. Be careful. No promises. Okie dokie. So we've updated our codex. I believe we've done everything we can here. Just go around the corner. Yeah, no new conversations. We're not going to go to Bryson's office yet. And Arya did not offer us her other thing. So, we're going to ship off. Apparently we have an email. Omega, it's time. Shepard's ready to discuss the pet project admission and we spoke in Perger. We come to Dock 42 on the Citadel. Container named Bray will be waiting. I kind of want to do that now. See? I think that the gun I want is available there. But first... We'll come up here and feed all of the fishies. We have new ones. We got the koi. So many fish. I don't have my pitcher. I also seem to be missing a bunch of ships. Okay. Maybe I spread them out more. Maybe that's what happened. But it looks like I'm missing some. Oh well. Either we'll find them or we will not. 
Uh, let's go to the combat information center. Commander. We'll go do our next mission. Do I want to go to do the Omega thing now? Stock. I do. We're just going to jump right into Omega. Get this taken care of now. Are you Bray? Uh, the great Commander Shepard. <laughs> and me without my autograph book. Save it. Just take me to Aria. Follow me. You think I'd show up dressed for combat? So where is she? Shepard. Apparently we're taking a ride. Aria. How dramatic. There are too many eyes and ears in purgatory. Yes, there are. I assume this is about retaking Omega? This is about your war, Shepard. Cerberus controlling the Terminus system seriously bolsters their mobility. Since taking Omega, they've spread through the galaxy. Surely the Alliance has noticed. Cut to the chase. What's your plan? Kick them out. I've amassed a fleet of Merc ships. We're going to punch through enemy lines and invade. Once we're on Omega, it's a ground war. That's why I want you. I only accept the best. The leader of the Cerberus occupation is General Oleg Petrovsky. He's the one who ousted me. Don't know him. The elusive man's top military strategist and best kept secret. But all you really need to know is that he's a merciless bastard. What are we looking at? What's your intel on the occupation? Petrovsky's army is massive and he's got Omega locked tight. The information stops there. So you're winging it? Not at all. There are secrets on Omega only I know. Secrets that will provide us a foothold. I can tell you this. Petrovsky's invasion was precise and ruthless. He'll stop at nothing to win. Some will say the same about you. Sounds familiar. Shepard, I know my reputation. I know I'm hated. I ruled Omega with an iron fist. But the people were free. Their lives were theirs. I preserved that. This man took all that away and he is going to pay. When Omega is mine again, I'll give you everything. I've got ships, mercs, Ezo, all yours for the war. What's the catch? I have objections to some of the company you keep. So you'll have to leave the Normandy and its crew behind. My crew are professionals. Let's just say... I want you all to myself. Yay. Bray will provide coordinates to my fleet. Oh, and while we're still in the Citadel, please be discreet. Okie dokie. The fleet is hidden in this system. Signal me when you're on your way. Arya and I will meet you on the command ship. <laughs> Can't wait to see what all the fuss is about. Okie dokie, dude. Okie dokie. Oh, well, we're back here. That was fast. So. I guess we'll just go straight to Arya's fleet. Uh, sort of uh, warships, transports, and fighters under Arya's flag. Let's go ahead and dock. Um, do I want to carry anything other than this? Don't really care. She has... Might as well modify your guns. You have that. Uh, 
sure have alloys. And then here. Go ahead and do that. I'm just curious. If I wanted to get a SMG, I would still be at 200. Wow, there's absolutely no reason not to do that then. If we like it, maybe I'll switch to a sniper rifle on that. But I kind of want to stick with a assault rifle. But if we can do an assault, a assault and a backup gun for when we run low on ammo. That's pretty amazing. Shrieking is not necessarily my favorite, if I remember correctly, but it's something. Okay, let's confirm this. I have four points. We're going to save that. Arya, let's do yours. What does Flair do? That sounds good. We'll start with three of that. Reeve. Uh... She is all about the damage. What is this? Okay. We can do power damage or health and shields. I don't really care about you long term. Have that. Beast weapon damage or power damage. You just shoot at random people, so whatever. You can make me better. Or you can become better. We'll do that for you. Whatever. I should be good. Some We're outshipped four to one. And most of our vessels are transports with limited firepower. We're not here to win a space battle, Jarl. We just have to punch through their line. So you've commandeered a Cerberus cruiser. The guest of honor has arrived. We can finally start. Let me guess. You're planning on infiltrating the enemy fleet. Exactly. We position ourselves to strike a crippling blow, then my forces join the fun. Sounds risky, but okay. A lot could go wrong. The assault's been planned for weeks, Shepard. For now, just sit back. Let me steer. Not the best start to our partnership, Arya. How things begin isn't nearly as important as how they end. Bray, move through the relay. Signal the fleet to wait. They only follow on my command. Okay, dokie. How bad can this Head get? for the command ship. Cruiser, I don't have you on the flight plan. Identify yourself. This is Captain Lentz. Run voice recognition. Alpha Tango Z. We took damage. Seeking repairs. Identity confirmed, Captain. Pulled for approach authorization. How did you get the captain to say that? The hard way. That's right. Nice and slow. Be patient. Get as close as you can. Fire! I think we could have got closer. Signal the fleet through the relay. We're through. Head straight for the station. We're being hailed by the general. Should be interesting. Put him through. Aria. I knew this had to be you. You'll never make it. Call it off now. You're barking up the wrong tree, General. But maybe you can convince my partner. 
Commander Shepard, I've heard great things about you. Can't really say the same, but all I've heard is from Arya, so... My partner here doesn't have much to say for you. She's not used to being defeated. It clouds her judgment. A pity you left, Cerberus. We all sabotage ourselves in nefarious ways. Perhaps deep down you fear success. And Arya clearly thinks seeing you will unsettle me. Now it's my turn. I see you've gone to the trouble of augmenting that ship with Solaris armoring. An exorbitant waste. I've made improvements to Omega's outer defenses. My cannons will cut through you at will. He sounds pretty confident. Yeah, he does. So again, I say turn back. Let's see what you've got, Oleg. End transmission. That went well. Set preset course. We're ramming the station. Everyone brace for impact. What? Omega's kinetic barrier will stop my ships from landing. I equipped this cruiser with disruptors to take it out on impact. Don't worry. We'll probably survive the crash. Well, they are firing at us. And we lost part of the ship there. Shields gone! All systems failing! We can make it! Aria, don't be stupid. Sound the evac. Damn it! Program escape pods for the station! Let's go! Everyone out! There's no time! This dude did not want to leave. That went badly for him. Guess that asshole really did upgrade Omega's outer defenses. So it would seem. Cerberus did always seem to have plenty of money to do what they wanted. Okay. Now for some fun. Hope the other escape pods made it. All right, what's our target? Need to hit the defense system station. Shut down Omega's outer defenses so my ships can land. If we don't, they'll be blown to bits like we were. Got it. We'll do that. This is what I brought you for. Ground assault. In combat, what you say goes. We'll go with the why am I skeptical. Are you really gonna listen to me? Aria relinquishing command? I'll believe it when I see it. I can be a team player, Commander. I know where we need to go, and you can get us there. Okay, let's move. Okay. So let's see what we have. I'm um, so I need to do that, and you go ahead and flip. Back, fuckers. I'll do that. You? I can't play it. Stupid clouds. Die! Okay, I think we're down. Oh no, we have a ton. Um. Uh. 
Okay, you ready to do something though? He's down. He's down. Still a ton. But less than what we had originally. Down. Doing okay on ammo, and we do have that backup gun finally. Uh, you go ahead and do that. Okay. So much smoke. So much smoke. Then there were three. Um, over here. Go ahead and do that. Okay. These are so many humans that could have been helping fight the Reapers. And instead, I'm wasting my time fighting them. You can't do anything. He's almost down. Uh, you... Go ahead and do that. He's down. Keep getting your shields back. Sadly, she does not have overload. Are we down to one? We are. You cannot throw out all the gas smoke that you need. Uh, go ahead and do that. Wow, we did go through most of our ammo. Our pod took out the main exit. Use the controls to lower the blast door. Okay, we're going to end the episode here. So, like and subscribe, and we'll be back next time to blast our way through Omega. If you have any uh, questions or comments, feel free to leave them below. Otherwise, I'll talk to you later. Adios.